Good day investors, uh, welcome to the understanding of your statement and reports from Quick Trade. This will explain to you uh, currently how to read your statement, understand the statement uh, for all clients uh, on Quick Trade. First of all, statement will be sent to you on a daily basis, even if you're in an open trade or in, even not in any trade at all. The account statement will look like this. Account, that's your username. Please take note. Please use the username at any time if you want to do payments uh, of funds into your account again. Locking, that is just a code for the client. Balance, that will show you the capital uh, in cash that's available in this account. Unreal ZPNL stand for profits and losses. It will actually show you all your profits and losses on all open positions. Account equity. It will explain to you in the end of day balance calculated by adding your unrealistic profit losses to your balance. Margin used for positions. Clients margin used to handle positions. So all your positions for all the trades that you're currently in will show how much funds that you've used for a margin deposit. How much uh, used margin percentage, how much of the percentage of your funds have been used in the trade. And as you can see, this is a 5.1% have been used in all the uh, positions that's open. Margin available. This is my, uh, uh, funds that's available still to be traded on this account. Margin warning. Clients balance value when the margin call is reached. So this is like a... Um, a protection on your margin availability in funds. Margin to stop trading, that will be a level at which a client is no longer able to open new positions. So if you've got so much funds available, you are you can't go lower than this. Stop out level, that means if this level is reached, all open positions will be closed automatically. Today's realized uh, profits and losses, that is basically the profit and losses realized from position day. So when from the day you've opened it till today, <coughs> what is your physically uh, profits and losses? Balance block by orders, funds to be set aside for pending orders. So if there's a open trade still available to be put into the market, that is the funds that are still being uh, put aside to go into the trade. Current value of stocks owned by client. This will be the function here. So that is a brief summary of all your physical trades on one screen. If you go lower, you're going to see the following. And this is very important to follow on a daily basis. And let's go through this. The open positions report shows all positions currently open. So open positions report means that's the shares you've got available in your share. Now if you go through this, and I'm going to just make it a bit smaller so you can actually see this. Instrument. Now an instrument means that's the type of share you've got. Account. That will be the account holder. And amount, that will be the amount of shares that's physically available that's been uh, got in this open share. Open price, very important. Open price means that's the price that you actually uh, got the uh, share at. Buy or sell, that's the type order. Buy means you went long. Sell means you went short. <coughs> Uh, open date, and that will be the date uh, that the share was bought and sold. Closing or current price, that is where the share is currently trading at. Stop loss, that will be where you will actually see what the stop loss level will be added on. Now that will be happening for management accounts and self-management accounts. If you did activate the stop loss level, it will show on this uh, uh, statement 
take profit level that is where you want to take profit at and that will also be needed to be added on the transaction when you open it if it's not showing there you didn't activate this facility at all profit and loss that means what is your current profit and loss on the specific trade commissions very important to follow what commission that you pay to actually get involved with this trade the following understanding your statement and reports the trade report shows all trade opera, uh, operations sell by instruments again account that's your account holder operation buy sell buy long sell short so take note if you did go for a buy again you went long if you went for a sell you went short price the price that you got to share at even if it's a uh, short or a long number of contracts that's the number uh, amount of shares that was obtained on this trade profits and losses what is the current profits and losses profits will always show in green losses in red on your trading system as well commission charged commission session and that is the commission you've paid please take note two types of commission minimum commission is 50 rand so it means if your your brokerage fee was 42 rand you will pay only a minimum of 50 rand if it's above 50 rand and let's say you paid a brokerage fee of 64 rand you will actually pay a fee of 64 rand so all brokerage fee underneath 50 rand will be seen as a minimum fee of 50 rand <clears throat> the open position report shows all positions currently open again instrument share that you've actually traded amount number of shares open price where you actually purchased it at type buy or sell did you go long or short open date that's the date of trade current price where it's currently trading at stop loss that's the level you want to actually take your loss on take profit that's your profit level profit and loss that's the current profit and loss on this trade and physically the last part you will see commission i hope this uh, statement will help you in the future uh, to make more detailed decisions and follow your trade at that time enjoy trading